Hello everybody, this is John with the Plan B Club. Um, I'm the lead developer and I thought I'd share with you some real simple trick. I, I've seen a few questions from time to time in the forums. I try to help out and answer, but I figured maybe a video might be a little easier. So um, the question is, um, how can I get rid of the PayPal button on um, my order form? Or in this case, actually, it's a shopping cart checkout. Uh, a lot of times uh, what people will want to do is disable or uh, better yet hide the PayPal button because they don't have a PayPal account and it only creates confusion for people during checkout. So I'm going to show you real quick. It's not very complicated. It's pretty simple to do. Um, all you have to do, uh, there's one thing to remember that I would have you keep in mind and that is that when you edit, you want to edit the theme if you try to edit the actual shopping cart and not the theme itself, then it won't work. It should work, but it doesn't, so um, just trust me on that. It just uh, doesn't work for some reason. It's probably just something uh, Infusionsoft hasn't gotten to. But if you edit the theme, I go in and I edit the theme. I'm going to go to Edit CSS. Now, when you edit CSS tab, you have two sections. One's for Appearance CSS and one's for Layout CSS. Almost all the way to the bottom, you're going to see a section that says MISC, for miscellaneous, of course. The item that you're looking for is dot checkout with PayPal link. You're going to add one line of code, and it's not too complicated. Visibility, colon, hidden and then remember to put a semicolon at the end. Save the change, and then when you go back, you can refresh the page to test it. Now you see it, and now you don't. Now this approach works for a number of elements. You can actually hide entire sections, but you have to know the name that you're looking for, etc. And uh, I'll try to do different videos on some of the more common ones, but I figured I'd share how to hide the PayPal link uh, so that uh, you don't have to have confused customers anymore. I hope that helps. Best of luck.